what can you do to prepare to come to Cal Poly for computer engineering? Uh, probably the first thing is to practice programming. If you've never programmed before, uh, there are some good websites out there. Code Academy is kind of fun. It's an interactive website which will teach you to, um, the rudimentary parts of programming. Uh, there's another website called Learn Code the Hard Way. Uh, there's a Python version which may be nice because uh, you are going to take CPE 101 and that's in Python. Uh, there are lots of uh, good books out there. Uh, I'm somewhat embarrassed to say that I learned how to see program C on my own out of a book called Learn C Programming in 24 Hours, which basically had 24 one-hour chapters in there. Um, but really, it just comes down to practice, 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 practice. Um, so after, you, if you have the intro or, or have done the intro, uh, create your own project. Try to come up with, uh, you know, a game or something, or, uh, a Sudoku solvers, a common CPE 101 final course project. If you can do that on your own, then CPE 101 will be a breeze. Um, on the hardware side, uh, it turns out about 30% of our students have prior robotics experience, FIRST or VEX robotics. Um, now those systems can be quite expensive, but if you're interested in robotics, you can uh, look up something called the Scribbler robot. Uh, that's got a nice little programming interface and it can be kind of fun. Uh, on the embedded system side, the Arduino user community uh, is very active and there's a tons of fun projects you can do with that uh, involve the Arduino, which is a microcontroller that you can program. Uh, and interface to other electronics to do things I don't know, around the house or whatever you want.